a dream that I was dating this really hot guy. I won't tell you who. I had a dream that we were dating and we were really happy and we were in love and then I woke up and now I'm really depressed. Cause where is he, you know? Babe, are you there? It was because I was watching the after movies. Like, like it was my punishment for watching those movies. Cause you, you know, they're like horrifically bad, but that's why they're good. Sue me. And now I'm so depressed. Whatever. I'm making coffee. Yeah, I'm a coffee addict. I'm actually just a caffeine addict because I also am addicted to Coke. Anyway, this is the stuff we got from Vermont. It is so good. I was trying to like not have any of this like syrup stuff for a while because it was like, oh, it's probably bad for you. And I was kind of on a health kick. And then I was like, it tastes so good. Like, sorry, like what? I don't even know what's in it. I don't care what's in it. It tastes really good. <laughs> actually having a heat stroke vanilla syrup I like it sweet I haven't been drinking oat milk lately cuz I was like oh it's bad for you and then I was like it can't be bad for you it tastes so good Look how beautiful it is outside. Hello? You know the really crappy thing though is that like now that I'm 22 and I still haven't ever kissed anybody I'm gonna have to be like being 22 if I'm lucky I have my first kiss. It's gonna be so awkward. It's gonna be horrible I genuinely feel like if somebody moved in to kiss me right now at the stage I'm at in my life I might duck because I wouldn't be expecting it. Like I'd be like, whoa, what are you doing? Maybe if he was like, you know, like Somebody I had a really big crush on. Like, what does a girl have to do to get a boyfriend around here? I know I don't leave the house that much. Everyone's like, just, you can't want it so bad. You want, have to be like, just focusing on your own life. Okay. That's what people who are in relationships say. Okay, because they don't understand how it feels to be 22 and never been kissed. I think that's where a lot of my mental issues stem from. I was just like, having never had a normal life. Is 2023 the year that I get a boyfriend? To be honest, I don't usually get ready for the day. I will just wear whatever I woke up in. But my sister is coming home from school right now, so we're gonna get ready and we're gonna go get coffee and we're gonna go get some stuff from the grocery store, so. One second. I'm not gonna lie, I forgot to turn the lights on when I went in there, and so I did put this on in the dark. As much as it's fun to be like, I don't even care what I look like, sometimes it's just nice to not feel like I look like a troll that woke up from under the bridge. Would that be maybe helpful if I showered in the morning, or if I took better care of myself? Yeah, probably. But, what are you gonna do? I think we're literally ready. I think I need to go put more deodorant on. I think I've been anxiety sweating and I'm not gonna lie I think anxiety sweat is like what actually smells bad Like I don't think normal sweat smells bad I think it's like anxiety sweat is like another level and I've been anxiety sweating a lot lately and I just think that's it's gross Sorry. No, 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 no. Usually I'm not this energetic. Usually I'm just like literally laying in bed depressed, but like It's a good day You got allergies? Oh Oh my god, paparazzi, paparazzi. Just seeing Elise's yeah. chauffeur here again. I'm pretty used to this role. I'm pretty good at it. She doesn't pay me anything, but. Yeah. This is why I need a boyfriend to take over Megan's role as the my driver. Hey Megan, look, it's you. Get it? It's dog poop. This is the tree I took a photo by like the day that I had my last day at my job. So I was done with it and I was out of purgatory. 
Nice. You look good. I think that's what I looked like in the photo though. I yeah. I was like, I was like, like why did I do a weird smile like that? I don't know. You were really, um, you were really sad. You were so pale. Okay. Where are the boys at? Should I cut it? I'm just kidding. Go ahead. Sure. That's so confusing. Sure, go ahead. Okay. Whoa, she's gone. He always keeps burping, you guys. Somebody stop her. thing ever is how I just always end up back in my room. If you're ever looking for me, I'm probably in my room. The day that I start getting out of bed earlier than like 11, it's over for every <laughs> single one of you bitches. <laughs> Michael Sarah, smash your pass. 100% smash. Seth Rogen, smash your pass. Smash, she's so funny. I think the little laugh he does like that. <laughs> That's very like endearing. <laughs> You're delusional. Oh, Vince Vaughn, smash your pass. Oh my god, no, I would actually. Yeah, I, would, I knew like, it. Marry him, I would have his children, like, because that man is like actually the entire package. Oh my god. He is, and he's so tall. Oh. Actually, like. How old is he? It doesn't even matter. Hibbity hobbity, East is on <laughs> his way. <laughs> It's been real, guys. <laughs> Bye. It smells like a grandma's perfume, but like in a nice way. Oh.